hey my friends Jean Serge Gagnon here so do you want to start a business you want to start a business in 2020 is it different than any other year <laughs> you bet it's different but I mean what is the difference and what are the things you have to watch out for that maybe you didn't have to watch out before but even then what's the general stuff that you have to know to run a business online we're going to talk about that in a second but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets yeah so what is the difference well first of all let's talk about the difference right if you want to start a business online today in 2020 there's a few differences that you know in 2019 you wouldn't have to worry about and of course and I'm talking about the COVID right the coronavirus all that those that has affected a lot of stuff sure there's the whole thing where people are working remote where people that can't work remote have lost their jobs so they're looking to build a business they're looking to make money online so there's a lot of people out there trying to you know trying to make money online trying to grow their 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 fans and trying to understand how all that works so we're going to talk about that in just a second but also there's the whole new set of people who understand a lot of things that in 2019 they wouldn't have understood you know like there's a whole slew of people using zoom and using facebook um, videos and using all these online tools just for their job that they never used before because they didn't have to now they use it because they have to because it's part of their day-to-day -day activity so there's lots more people out there that know how to use the online tools so that makes a big difference it makes a big difference in the strategies that you need to use and the things you need to do in the sense that you're going to attract more people and you got to be more specific into how you're going to try to attract them because if you're for example you know in 2019 you could have done a post saying hey you want to learn how to do zooms you want to learn how to do uh Facebook videos you want to learn how to do Facebook lives you want to know how to do Facebook messenger or how to do these different things you could have attracted people to teach them that and they would have <clears throat> you know loved you for it and learned it and started using it but now they all know it or at least lots of them do and if you do that kind of a um, <clears throat> marketing you're not going to have the same impact right so that's one thing you have to remember the difference in the audience it has changed the audience has changed their education level has changed what they know what they do what they what they need to learn that they don't know is different I'm gonna uh, go let me just go look here at something I have I actually just did a search one of the things that is definitely important for you to do if you're trying to build a business online is learning how to build a business online right it's not just about building a business if you already know how to build a business you already know lots of stuff that people that don't even know how to build a business but if you're new and you're trying to figure out how to build a business you know from the ground up there's a lot of resources out there that'll help you to grow a business online so there's a lot of things I could talk about you know business specifics you know like keeping track of your expenses keeping track of your income making sure that you have the information available for your account and once you start to do your taxes that's all boring stuff in the beginning you're not going to make a ton of money so you might not need to worry about that but it, but at the same time getting a good foundation for that is important so it's it's up to your personality right for me I'm like okay I'm just going to start I'm going to go I'm going to try to build it and I'm going to start to gen generate income if I don't generate income I'm not going to worry too much about it uh, but by the but when I do I'll pay an accountant to deal with that right that's kind of my thought right I'm not sure about what your thought process is but that's how I look at it I'm just going to go for it and then I'm going to hire an accountant to deal with the accounting <laughs> you know that's 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 it for me that's it but you know for you it might be different right maybe you you want to learn how to uh, to do it all yourself maybe you like numbers maybe you like to figure it out maybe you like to be in control maybe you like to do that so maybe you should look into that but like a like I said you can search and find all these things online and find all that information by just googling for it right so for me for example 
you know I kind of know what I did to start my business online I know how to how I started to grow my followers I started to produce content regularly I started to create a blog I started to do videos like this video I'm doing right now this this episode I'm doing right now I mean I started doing that and then I started to grow an audience now I have people that follow me I have people that like they they trust me they think they think I know what I'm talking about and anybody who's new wouldn't know right if you're new and you've never heard of me before you might be like what's he talking about does he really know what he's doing right so you know when you want to start a business online it's pretty it can be very very complicated you can maybe take you know months to start a business online you can try to build a business like Facebook or Amazon that'll take forever to do uh although it's still possible to start something that'll that'll grow over time and, and you know bootstrap it but really that's not what most people should be focusing on you should be focusing on finding something that's out there that you can promote that you can sell that you don't have to worry about building the infrastructure for right so that's what that's where affiliates programs come in you know uh, affiliate programs or network marketing companies that kind of stuff that you can actually take part in and just start promoting online but the thing is that the promotion online that's the part that most people don't understand you can't just start promoting your business you can't just start telling people about your your product about your course about your about your opportunity about your service you can't just bug people about that you know just imagine if you went to a barbecue and you started talking to all the people there about this business you started you know they they and they might be interested if they already know you but if they don't know you if you're like this stranger that's coming into the, the barbecue nobody's going to want to listen to you nobody's going to want to talk to you because they're going to be annoyed at you for trying to tell them about something that they have no interest in right but in the real world it's no different than online you can't just start talking about your business you got to build a relationship first you got to get to know them you got they have to feel that you care about them before they all care about you that's just the nature of things that's just how humans are right they need to know that you care about them before they'll care about you so that's why you have to start your business by looking at things like for example uh how 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 do you start so you start to produce posts online right you start to have conversations with people you connect with them you send them messages you you make a comment about their about their profile about their pictures about their things that they have online right so you do things like that and that's one of the things right so you know that's one of the things so building a business online is not super complicated but the the reason why it's so hard for people is that we we look at other businesses that are online the ones that have huge success and we see what they're doing looks like they're talking about their products they're promoting their products right you see ads on tv you see ads in the radio you see all that stuff so you think that well it's our natural instinct to think that's what we need to do we need to do ads right we need to to promote our product and we need to just post that everywhere right but the, but on social media you can't do that you cannot do that for lots of reasons first people don't like that but the main reason the more even important more important reason is that the platform doesn't like it like on Facebook that's why they say you shouldn't be building your business on your personal profile profile if you've heard that before and the reason why you shouldn't is not because you know people won't like it as much or I mean sure that's that's important but the main reason is because Facebook doesn't like it so when they see it and when to, and then when they notice that you're doing that they might shut down your profile so you lose everything you lose all your connections you lose all your messages you lose all your posts you lose your account you have to start over right so you don't want to do that you don't want to have to start over so you want to plan it properly that's why on Facebook you have a page a fan page it's no not much different on other platforms although some of them are more geared toward business right like LinkedIn for example is a little bit more geared toward business but you still don't want to be spamming about your stuff you want to be posting value to uh to your audience things that your audience is interested in seeing things that they're interested in doing so how do you start online well the first thing you got to do is you got to set up your social media accounts because nowadays and in 2020 it's all about social media it's all about social media platforms all about social media connections about engagement about um being being there right so first you got to do that the other thing uh number one like I said number one 
create your social media profiles now you don't have to post everywhere but you probably should have your profile set up uh, on different platforms using the same profile picture using the same con the same tagline the same uh, user id if you can right so if you can do that that's probably better right so if uh if you want to make sure that you don't have any um differences later on in the future you want to be able to say I have the same um profile pictures um the same the same like I said the same user id all that stuff so and the other thing is you might want to set up a blog now your blog doesn't have to be something that you uh something that you um maintain all the time but you could set it up to start with right just set up a first a first thing on there and set it up so that you can start to pr pr provide some content you can do one blog a month if you want uh, but if you're using the blogging platform the blogging as the way to build your business then of course you want to do it more than once once a month you want maybe even every day right but the thing is that starting to create content is the priority and the next priority which is even more important because your content has to be value content it can't be like I said promotional content there's I have simple online strategies that I did I talked about before I've got an ebook that lists out the 10 the 10 simple online strategy you really need to follow that's still valid today in 2020 like I said with the COVID with with everybody being home with everybody re remote working remote learning all the online tools it's different today because the audience is different they have more understanding of things but you know once you have your social media account set up once you have your blog set up then you need to set up an auto responder what's an auto responder an auto responder is an email um, platform a platform where you can set up emails that go out to a, a bunch of people that they are on your list right you know your list is where people will be uh where they'll be connected you will have their emails how do you get their emails there's lots of different ways right I mean I one of the things that I really like is a platform called my lead system pro if I show you this let me just show you here if I go to here I'm just going to load it up first and then I'm going to share the screen to show you because I first have to log in and uh and all that but I want to show you one of the things that is one of the big things is if you want to have um if you want to have a platform a social media platform um you can have something like this my lead system pro right so in here in my lead system pro they give you for free uh pages that you can use to attract people to you like if I look at this this an example here build your first ebook right you can give this away to people you can give them this for free give them this ebook that lets them show a video and a training that shows them how to create their first ebook so that's one of the things you need right you need to have the ability to give somebody something so that they will give you their email right that's one of the things that they have here the ebook the other one is you know get your Facebook page to 7,000 likes right how to do that how do you get your your Facebook page to 7,000 likes in 30 days right how do you get them targeted likes right proper likes this is a training that you can give away for free somebody who wants this they just go you just give them a link and they will give you their email to you not not to my lead sister but to you same thing with the, the I don't know there's a bunch as you can see there's a whole bunch of them let's say this one Instagram training right how do you how to build your Instagram how to do Instagram marketing secrets right how to do it right what's the what's the what's the best way to build your audience on Instagram how do you grow your audience on Instagram here's a free training on how to do that you can give that away to people you can give them that how to build on on Twitter right how to build on Twitter how do you build on Twitter simple three-step Twitter formula right how to generate leads on Twitter how to get sales on Twitter you can give that away they just have they just need to give you their email you give them that training um what else you can also give them storytelling how to you know teach effective stories right how to how stay at home mom and serious storyteller makes more money than most doctors by telling simple stories to print money in your business you can give them away this free training how to do that you can give them uh MLM training how to sponsor six reps 
in network marketing right it's 15 years successful MLM vet finally turns the internet and recruits six reps with five dollars per day Facebook ads so that's using a Facebook ad strategy to to get recruit network marketing reps in your MLM you can give them that free training away how to how to sell MLSP like me I'm talking about MLSP right now right 24 reasons how to get free leads using my lead system pro you can give that away to somebody I can give that to you if you want you can have that and you can give it to others too if you want uh what else there's as you can see there's a whole bunch of them right and not just that right in my lead system pro you also get what else there's profit campaigns there's actually things you can sell if you don't have a product if you don't have anything to sell right now you can actually take these and you can promote them and sell them if you want to sell this productivity productivity secret you can sell this um, to people uh, they'll give you the name and email and then you'll be able to sell it to them for for nine dollars it's only nine bucks you sell it to them for nine bucks you get a hundred percent of the profits it's all yours same thing with all these see ninety seven dollars seven dollars seven dollars seventeen dollars the 30-day challenge uh ML, my lead system pro challenge you can give that away learn how to grow your audience influence and income you know, the create your own courses have your own membership team training site charge customers monthly subscriptions so you can do all that so these this is one example anyways that's just one example let me just go back here to the webcam I mean that's just one example of something you can use online to start your own business in 2020 this this platform is insane I've been I've been using it for years I've been using it to grow my leads I've been learning all sorts of things using it and and you know I'm not saying you, that's the only way because you can build a business online by just having a product that you believe in a product that you sell or a product that you even created you can create your own website and start promoting that but what I'm telling you is that it's super important that you don't just promote that whether it's your own product or you're promoting somebody else's product or you're using my lead system pro as a platform to promote I mean it, it's important that you don't just promote you really have to do and I'm going to show you here my if I if we go to my blog do I have it here someplace I have a tab here I'm sure uh, for my blog let's just do a new, a new window we'll go to my blog let's share the page here okay so I mean if I go to my blog right uh sales I know that com if I go to my blog um if you're listening to the audio obviously you can't see this but I'm going to my blog right now and it's jeansergegagnon.com and you can see I have a whole bunch of different posts in here but one of the things is this simple online strategies this is one thing I highly recommend you get um when you click it it takes you to master of simple you just need to put your name and email and you get the ebook and that ebook is available uh actually if I just go here I'm just going to show you what it looks like if I go here and you know that's the thing so on on this site the this stuff is there and you can access it and this is what the ebook looks like right <clears throat> and let me just uh, move that out of here so oops where am I I'm over here I'm not looking at the right screen I'm just waiting for it to load here it's coming up it'll come in a second but I mean you know on my blog right uh there's other things there's also the Facebook ads for profits there's all these different uh, pages that you can look at <coughs> and let's see did that load yes it is no it's not loaded yet <coughs> it's loading up it's loading up it's supposed to be loading up it's loading up it's not loading up okay well anyways they've you I'll fix that to make sure that that works when you go there but if you go to my blog and you click on this image on the on the on the right right hand side of the blog I'm going on the right on the, on the right on this side right on that side of the page you're going to see this top 10 simple online strategies right there and you're going to be able to see you're going to be able to get that ebook by just putting your name and email but that ebook is 
basically uh let me show you this basically it's these different the, these these 10 different things right and these are things you need to learn how to do you got to make sure you do these you know set a good profile picture make your post public don't post company or product names choose single strategy but brand your brand your name be congruent define your demo engage on everything connect daily and learn the 80 20 rule so all these things are super important to build a business online today and and it's yours for free you just go to the site and enter your name and email but you know that's the thing so that's what you got to do online you got to create your accounts you got to start create content start connecting with people produce valuable content to grow your audience you got to grow your audience before you can actually sell anything if you try to sell things without growing your you know without uh if you try to promote without getting to know them they're not going to be interested that's why we talk about the no like and trust factor right you gotta know they gotta get to know you before they like you and before they trust you I keep saying that all the time if you've been listening or watching my my episode you know I talk about that all the time grow no like and trust it that's like the most important thing so that means when you're trying to connect with people when you're trying to have conversation with them you have to be interested in them it's 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 just like in real life if you go to a barbecue and you want to talk about your business there's no point in talking about your business unless you know about them unless you know that they might be interested in it unless you unless they feel that you're interested in them if you're if you if you talk to them about your business without first talking to them about you know their cats and their dogs and their farm and their house and their family and their work and their interests and all that and if you don't talk about that first they're not going to be interested in hearing about your business they, they it's a it's a reciprocity thing the and that's how it all works that's it so hopefully this helped and this is this and and this will help you to start your business in 2020 and if you have any questions please feel free to reach out and let's have a conversation see how I can help you specifically with your business with what you're trying to build with what you're trying to do I'd love to help you so just reach out let's have a conversation either send me a message an email reply to one of my emails go to my blog find me on social media I'm everywhere so just go ahead and send me a message let's have a conversation I'd love to help you all right have yourself a great day until next time this has been course income secrets the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom. Some of your friends need to hear this message, so don't forget to share. For more content like this, go to CourseIncomeSecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here. My name is Jean-Serge Gagnon. Until next time.